let's continue down this road of amazing mail. I have another box today uh, that arrived. I don't remember the themes. Let's see if I can remember them. Scream, House of a Thousand Corpses, Wrong Turn, Motel Hell, and I think there might have been another one, but I don't know for sure. Now, Scream has been an autograph in many boxes, so I'm going to say that Scream is not the autograph in this one. I think they're going to play it a little bit different. I'm going to guess that it's a House of a Thousand Corpses autograph. That's my guess. Open. There we go. So let's get this opened up. This is from Zobi. This is their Fright Crate in this pretty box here. So let's see what we got in here. All right. Start right on the top here. We got a pin. Artist edition. This is out of 600. This is our screen piece. We got Drew Barrymore on the phone. That scene was actually inspired by When a Stranger Calls, the original movie. So let's see what this says on the back here. Boop. Boop. Number 579 out of 600. The red, I thought, was the variant. So this might be the variant pen. We'll find out. Moving on to the shirt. So this is our Motel Hell piece. Motel Hello, home of Farmer Vincent Meats. It takes all kinds of critters to make Farmer Vincent fritters. So that's pretty cool. I like how they're doing like this kind of touristy shirt. Um, it says it won't cost an arm and a leg to stay at Motel Hello. People will appreciate what we are doing here for years to come. I have not seen this movie in years, so I don't have much to say about it, unfortunately. Two pieces left. This is going to be a short video. Eh, so this is the wrong turn piece. 8x10 print says dead end I can't tell if this is the original wrong turn I haven't seen the original in so long but the remake or the reboot or whatever you want to call it I loved it I really wish it would have given it a different name and just not tied it to wrong turn but I thought it was a really enjoyable movie and last but not least our autograph now it seems like House of Thousand Corpses is the one we haven't seen yet so I was right that's amazing. Pow. So this is, let's see, that is Earl Firefly. You see him at the very end of the movie for a good two minutes. Um, says, see you under the house. Can't remember the actor's name. And there's no cheat sheet. So um, while I look this up, Earl Firefly, let me just tell you something. How did I guess that this is going to be Earl Firefly? How did I remember his name? Because I feel like that's not a name everyone really knows. Well, Earl Firefly, a.k.a. the Professor, was the husband of Gloria Mama Firefly and fathered two children with her, Tiny Firefly and possibly Rufus Firefly. According to Gloria, he was a very nice and kind-hearted man until one day he snapped. Uh, let's see. Played by, okay, so Jake McKinnon. I knew that this was going to be House of Thousand Corpses, not because I am a genius, but because I saw a spoiler. So, kind of takes away from the excitement on it. But, it's a cool piece. I have a spot right there above the picture reserved for him to go up on my House of a Thousand Rejects wall. Uh, and I, I do actually really enjoy this piece. This is not Dr. Satan. Don't mix him up with Dr. Satan. This is the Professor Earl Firefly. So all in all, not a bad box. Uh, I did put my Zobi on hold for now. Um, I paused the subscription for it. I don't need a lot of shirts, and that's like the one of the things that comes in every box. Same with pens. I have plenty of pens. Um, I think the reason that there is no cheat sheet is they moved to a new way of doing it. Now, because I was not prepared for that, uh, let me see if I can find it real quick without wasting too much of your time, but I feel like if you don't care about the cheat sheet, now is a decent time for you to just hit that thumbs up, leave me a comment, and all of that, uh, because I don't know where I'll find it, and I don't feel like making you wait for me to 
struggle to do so. So I'll put some details in the bottom on what the cheat sheet says once I find it. I apologize for wasting a little bit of your time, but thumbs up, like, subscribe, do all that. You're my friends. I appreciate you. Have a great week.